All right, what is up, you guys? And of course, always welcome back to our wife Abel versus now a Twitter follower and really friend. I've been talking with this guy for at least a half a year, and he's called Smash Bender. He calls himself also Bojack here, and um, I switched around the team a little bit. Um, wanted to try something a bit, I was gonna say different because it's not necessarily that different, but at the same time, I just wanted to have something fun, and hopefully, that doesn't punish me too much. Um, <laughs> I know that Smashbender is a competitive battler, and um, that also means we gotta face tough, yeah, precisely, um, tough opposing threats. But um, I'm just gonna say good luck, have fun to my opponent. There is something really nice here, and that is that we see a Halucha, but we don't see terrain. Um, however, Curse lies. Mmm, that's not annoying. Um, so. <laughs> Let's see, how do I want to level here? Like, there is very few ways of me beating Drapion. That looks to be one hell of a Pokemon to beat. And the same here with... Um, I'm just gonna lead off with the Molga, I feel that makes sense. But basically I have no way of dealing with Cursula or Haolucha in a proper way. And um, Stami, I think I can hold off somewhat. But if it is Meteor Beam, then you know, it's kind of it's kind of up there. Um, basically, like his team is very fast, so I think I'm gonna rely heavily on um, <laughs> actually Slowbro to kind of break through somehow. Uh, my Slowbro is a Belladrum Quick Closet, and it is as stupid as you get. So if it works, it's gonna be nice. But if it doesn't, well, what do you expect? <laughs> Let's see. These are when I'm the Streepion, and um, I think we're gonna get that EC Volt Switch going. He has no Pokemon that is grounded, which is nice. And I don't want to risk, you know, flinch battling him here. He could be just a lead taunt variant with Toxic Spikes, and that would be just right. Uh, also, Emolga gets Energy Ball Decineration, which is awesome. It doesn't make it really good, but uh, it, it does make it kind of <laughs> kind of fun to use. So let's see, Choice Specs, yeah, it doesn't break anything. Uh, but the classic set of Emolga is actually with Nussle, and uh, the reason for that is because it actually is super flexible. Um, so I'm gonna send in Hadar and um, basically try to get my speed up. So let's see, knock off, getting off my life orb. It's not the end of the world, however the damage is absolutely that. Um, it's alright, because his switch in should be... he has no fairy. Yes, he does, but um, I think a scale shot anyway. I don't, will not get the life orb damage, and uh, I don't believe Poison Jab is in range of killing me, and Curse Lash should be his only real switch in. So I feel confident. I'm not super scared. I kind of want to save my Sucker Punch, however. Um, because. Sucker Punch would be nice versus Stommy if case that gets out of hand. Let's see, he does decide to stay and go for Toxic Spikes, so this means that next turn we could potentially outspeed him. Um, let's see, Scale Shot does... <laughs> not really that impressive, and two extra... Yeah, that did not exactly what I wanted to do. That did really bad, didn't it? That did really bad. I guess we're going for the burn then. Fire Punch. <laughs> right, that did a lot worse than I thought it would be. Let's see, Whirlwind, so that's awful. Did not expect that. Let's see, back into Hitmon Top. Hmm. Now, he is somewhat of a bulkier build. So. I could try going for a triple axle here. I could be speedier. I could be. I am. Let's see. One hit. Two hits. Last one will kill. There you go. Nice. Drapion is out. But we have no way of actually taking away the toxic spikes. That's going to be phenomenal. And um, positive part is that I'm poisoned, which means that Will Always from Cursula will not be the end of the world. So that's a good thing. 
There are a few switches here that actually benefit from coming into Gursula. But, yeah, like I said, there is no way of me actually getting rid of... Uh... That's gonna be annoying, isn't it? <laughs> like, it dawned on me now. Not having a spinner on the team is probably not the best wrath. Because he's really thinking about this, which is actually good. Let's see, going into Holy Hook. Hmm. Do I have a switch for this? I mean, not really. I'm gonna actually bullet punch here, at least get some damage on it. I'm not particularly keen on a <laughs> Rapidash or Clear Rapidash, but that did good. That did good damage. So there's a play rough, Hitmon Top is out, and uh, I mean, I'm clearly satisfied with that. Um, now the issue is that Immolgate's not faster, Calamil, while faster, will not break it. So my switching is theoretically Chinchino. And that's never pleasant. Um, but Rapidash is 105 speed, so that basically means that no matter what I do, I'm still in a rough position. Um, now skill link is nice, but uh, that's about it. Ah, it's triple axle. No, I can't miss. Bullet seed, rock blast. I mean, I want a tail slap, but and then again... Ah, bullet seed. My most accurate move. Oh, yeah, he's scarfed. He's scarfed. No matter. How about that? <laughs> that demolished him. Cool. So, right, I have, I think, one switching left in me. Like a sack play at best. So his best play is probably bring Halucha and go for that weird close combat white herb combination as Halucha is the only Pokemon out speeding me. White Widow. Alright. I take any ship I can get on this. So I go for the triple axle, hope I connect and uh, take it from there. Let's see. Got one. Got two. Got the third. Nice. So we died to that. Now let's see. Could go for Strength Sap. Nightshade. Cool. Um, now here's the thing. I think my best play here is uh, just Volt Switch, actually. Because, yeah. I can't beat it. But Strength Stab should be his only, like, real recovery play, I think. We'll see what happens. That would be the worst case scenario, really. Get myself poisoned. Mirror Coat. Ah, nice. That's actually... That's actually kind of bad. <laughs> That's new. <laughs> Let's see, I'm out of HP. Was he at? He even. <laughs> I guess we gotta bring the big guns then. Huh. That was unfortunate. I mean, Volt Switch again kind of beats him, but we'll just we'll just try to take him out here. Like, he has no real switch in besides maybe... Um, all right, he stays in. Is it real switching here? It could be potentially slow king. Oh, we don't beat it. Ah, oh, strength zap. I don't believe it should be getting too much HP back. I hope. I think that's plenty. Ah, oh, it's frustrating. Like I don't want to take a mirror code. I really don't. I don't know what option. I kind of need to hold for paralyzation, don't I? Planned hacks, please. Cursed body, that's phenomenal. Mirror coat, don't beat me. No, but... Oh my god, I might as well struggle to death. 
So he can't strength set back. <laughs> I have a vision. So right, um, I'm clearly losing this game and that fully paralyzation didn't help. Um, ah, this is bad. This is really bad actually. Ah, just my luck. I mean, it's not over, but at the same time, there is just... How do I beat this again? I set up a Tailwind and hope that he's paralyzed, but then I can't beat Slow Row, so it doesn't matter. Yeah, we knocked this guy out for sure, like, no matter what, that is exactly what we're doing. And, um... Basically, I need to hope that Slow Row works. Thank you, Curse Bunny! <laughs> You're an absolute blast. Thank you. Because poison, like I don't beat poison no matter what. So slow King or Slow Bro or whatever it, it is the mod that's gonna be absolutely beating me. Uh, I like that I actually forgot that my Slow King or Slow Bro is actually poison. I could have gotten rid of it Toxic Spike no matter what. He gets the quick draw. Phenomenal. Nice. Perfect. Do I live this? Please do. Nice. <laughs> like, do I have a switch in left anyway? At least, no matter what happens, I actually have one attack left. Which is awesome. Um, he's special though. So, let's see. We get rid of Toxic Spikes. I have no idea how to beat him at all. We build it wrong for sure. <laughs> come on, come on, please let me get something fun out of this. Because basically... Like, how does it work with both Belladrum and uh, Quick Claw? Let's see. Skull. Nice. Uh, take it. Yes. Alright, now I need that Liquidation to kind of kick in. Come on, go first. Quick Draw! A Liquidation will do! Quick, quick Draw there too, but I'm faster. Let's see. <laughs> Come on! Come on! Yes! Yes! <laughs> Alright, it's not over. I think. <laughs> because, can I do any, like, poison jab, right? Come on, 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 come on. No! Bastard game! Bastard game! Jesus! Fuck! I was way out of my depth though, right? There was no way I was gonna like win this game anyway, but ah, uh, I had to win. I had a 40% chance of winning. But yeah, I enjoyed this. I mean, it was UU-ish. I mean, I clearly had a little bit of a weaker Pokemon. My opponent had a few over in the OU sign, but that's that's what you get, right? There's, it's, I told him it's actually all right. Uh, so that is absolutely on me. But yeah, knock him out, nah. So we'll lose here 2 oh, like I said, it's okay. And um, I mean had I got a quick claw, I would have beaten both the Stami and the Halucha, but it it was a risk, and quite frankly, I kinda screwed myself over the second I let the dad um Kursla actually uh, get get all the shenanigans on me. Um if anything, thinking about it, I probably, since Kursla wasn't a number one threat towards me, I should absolutely just have built around the front of its face. So, it was an absolute mistake on my side, but at the same time, I, I enjoyed myself here. It was a fun game. So, to Smash Better, GG, figure the battle. <laughs> really overwhelming power. <laughs> you got me good. Everybody else, thank you for watching, of course. Have a great day, everyone. Bye.